in the light. I, 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 cut us down, man, you multiply. I don't care, man, I fly to you. Air Jordans while I take flight. That was a line from back in the day. Big up, Gershon, we'll be doing fine. I, I, where the time go? Bye bye to my old flow. Risky, I'm like, hey, we will be talking about dread lock, dread rot, and moldy locks. Is this a thing? It is, but it is not a death sentence. It does not mean your locks is in the shits. Literally. <laughs> You don't know what that means? Okay, think about wetting your towel and you roll it up in a ball and you throw it in the corner. Once it dries up, you open it up and it has this weird, not so pleasant smell. That is what moldy locks is. So think about that. When you don't wash your hair fully out and you leave all those chemicals or whatever products in, it festers in your locks. Or if you don't dry your locks properly, you think it's dry and you put it up in a ponytail, but the center, it not right. Hey guys, have you subscribed? Cause you're always here. You might as well just click that subscribe button and be a part of the Tiger Lily squad. Gang, gang. And not in a negative, creepy way, but in a positive, uplifting Tiger Lily squad, you know, the high under the chin type way. Oh, okay, we, we're doing too much. Let's get back to the video. But you can cure it, people. You can cure it. You can deep condition your hair. Um, you can just make sure your hair is properly dry before you do anything with it. Don't tie up your hair when wet. Don't do it because that's the worst. Never sleep with wet hair. You may think that you washed your hair at 7 a.m. You retwisted it. Everything is Gucci fruity. You're air drying it and you may think that it's dry but it's not. And then you go to sleep with your hair wet. Fam, who does that? Don't do that. Get a dryer to help aid that process. If you don't have time to sit out and have your hair air dry, get a hair dryer. Use a proper shampoo to help clarify all that product in your hair. Cause you might have a lot of product buildup, which is ca causing the dread rot or the moldy situation. least tea tree oil helps fight the moldy smell and the moldiness that's coming through thy locks because it ain't coming through mine boo boo but this <laughs> there's no judgments we all are family but i'm just here to help you out with your stinky holy ghost locks i'm joking why did i say that that's not cool. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to hit up my other channel, That Girl With Locks, to stay updated with your girl as I go through my health journey, life changes, situation, and other things. All right? See you later, Tiger Lilies. Toodles. Crash course. Let me have the money in the dashboard. Max mad, could you lost the brick inside the Porsche? Goofy with the curb.